guys, it is Got Reacts here, and the brand new Dumping Ground Series 9 trailer has just officially dropped. So I thought today we'd react to this. If you're a fan of our other channel, Gate of Theories, you will know that we absolutely love the Dumping Ground franchise and all of the Tracy Beaker shows, and we have been hyping up the Dumping Ground Series 9 for so, so long. Personally, I do feel like, unfortunately, the show has been on quite a down low for the past few years, and especially Series 8, I just really didn't like. The only episode that I liked was Tyler and Jodie, well, Tyler just leaving and Jodie getting really upset about it. And the rest of the episodes, I just didn't really connect to that much. So what I'm really hoping is that this brand new Series 9 trailer will give us some hope that this series will be like all of the classics that we absolutely love. We know there's going to be lots of new characters, but we also know that the pandemic isn't going to be incorporated into this series, uh, confirmed by Kia Peg, who plays Jodie herself. So this is going to be interesting what it's going to look like. But anyway, let's get on with reacting to this brand new trailer. So already at the beginning, we've got the Ashdeen Ridge logo and you just can't go wrong with Ashdeen Ridge. This is already making me very excited. Let's go for it. Coming soon in the dumping ground. This is really the st Glad to see we're getting all of our famous characters already in. Taz, Sasha and Bird already. Start with something special. Don't worry. Floss, Candy Rose and Jody. Here we go. Got this. Welcome. Ruby and Clem. So we've known that new characters are going to be coming and as for Ruby's case for returning, she of course appeared in series eight in one of the only episodes that I actually liked where she caused a little bit of conflict with Beck because her mum was the person who killed Beck's mum. But it looks like Ruby is going to be returning somehow and joining the cast for a full main series and actually moving into the Dumping Ground. So I'm so excited to see what that might lead to, the conflict between Beck and Ruby and how Ruby will react with the other characters as we didn't really get to see that last time. So I'm really looking forward to that. And this is also Clem, the brand new character who we've known about for a while. We don't really know much about her, but I mean, looks pretty cool. So let's just wait and see. I think we're Oh, and there, I don't know whether you saw that there was a really short clip, and here it is, of the brand new character, Murphy, who lots of us have been theorising, me as well, and I think by now it's probably almost confirmed since Sasha was there just before, and now this brand new character, Murphy, that this is actually Sasha's younger brother, grown up, and has now joined the dumping ground. If you want to see more about that, there's a whole video in which you can go and click somewhere up in the card on our main channel, Gate Theories, where we discuss this. And it does look like Murphy is definitely going to be Sasha's brother now, just a grown up. And does this mean that it's Paige in the way for Sasha to maybe leave at the end of the series? I really don't want her to. But since a brand new character related to Sasha is coming into the Dumping Ground, that might mean it's time for Sasha to go. I couldn't get my best friend back. Fred ah, so it looks like we've got Sid and Fred having all of his drama. I've just never felt anything for anybody before. Oh dear, Jay's in love with someone. Here we go. This is going to be very interesting. You can't help me! No one can! Yes, this is what I'm talking about. Jody getting really angry. Of course, at the end of Series 8, we did realise that Jody did ask for help with her anger problems. She's going to be going to the Sweet and Sour Project. And it looks like what she's going to have to deal with is all of her anger problems building up. We know she's had them for a while now. And I'm going to be interested how the series deals with this. Because currently, the series nowadays doesn't really deal with that much serious topics. Apart from stuff like with Jody. So I can't wait for that. And Kia Peg, as always, is brilliant at acting like this. And you can see just from there, brilliant as ever. I've made my mind up. I want to leave Ashton Ridge. Oh my word. So that Floss just said there that she might leave Ashley Ridge. Don't know whether that's true or not, because there's always times where characters are like, maybe I will, maybe I won't. If she does though, I reckon we will be seeing Ross again returning since, you know, they're kind of brother and sister, kind of not. It's complicated to explain them to. However, if Floss does leave, I mean, I definitely think it's about time. Personally, I know some people will completely disagree with me on this. Personally, I do think she should have left quite a while ago, like when Harry and the twins were all leaving, uh, because, I mean, she's kind of lost everyone who she was really close to. So I do think if this series is going to choose for a time to floss to leave, I think it would be definitely now. It's never a dull day at the dumping. Ah, so Chloe there looking really sad. Now, there's been lots of rumours that Chloe is also leaving since she hasn't really been seen much on set and was only really seen in Series 9A filming. So lots of people are thinking that she is going to leave. 
I personally think it's true as well, and I reckon, unfortunately for Chloe, it might be her time to leave as well, since we've got rid of Ryan quite a few seasons ago. We've had time to know Chloe, but I think now she's came to the end of her character. Now, Katie here. I hope they do more with Katie, and I hope to do more with Max, and just all of the younger characters, because currently, even though Katie was introduced, what, before Mike left, I still barely even know, like... What her personality is, I'm, I'm sorry to say this, but I don't really think the show's like done that character well. So I do hope this series that they actually do more with her. It's going to be fabulous. Yes, it is Candy Rose. And That's right. Finn is back, oh my word. So we didn't actually know whether Finn was going to be returning to the series or not because of all of the pandemic situations and the actor's own health, but it looks like he is definitely going to be appearing in it, so I'm so excited for that. I thought they might see him via like Zoom calls, which they might still do, and yeah, who knows, but Finn is definitely back, so I'm so excited about that. The 11th of June on CBBC. And there's Max and Clem and Scott. And BBC iPlayer. I think I'm going to have a lot of fun here. I think you are, Clem. Well, guys, that was the brand new Dumping Ground Series 9 trailer. What did you guys think about it? Let me know all your thoughts down below in the comments. Make sure that you've liked this video as well and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you want to know any more Tracy Beaker or Dumping Ground videos from us, I will leave a link down below to our playlist in the description if you want to go and check them out and all of our Series 9 theory videos as well as to what might be coming this new series. Let me know down below in the comments what you're most excited for for about series nine in this trailer. Currently, it's looking pretty good. I'm just really hoping that it is better than series eight because series eight, it just wasn't the same, was it? So I'm really hoping that this series is better and back to those classic series that we love. And unfortunately, this was only the trailer to, I think, Series 9A. So it just means that Series 9A is going to be starting on the 11th of June. And I cannot wait. Make sure that you subscribe because we'll be doing lots and lots of brand new Dumping Ground videos. And when Series 9B comes out, we'll, of course, be reacting to that as well. And as always, we've been here at Got Reacts. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys later. Don't be a stranger.